Welcome to 60 Second Civics from the Center for Civic Education. I'm Mark Gage. Today, we launch a special week-long series of Pride Week podcasts with our special guest, Christopher R. Riano, the president of the Center for Civic Education and co-author, along with William Eskridge of Marriage Equality, From Outlaws to In-Laws. Christopher, what were the Stonewall riots and why are they seen as such an important milestone in the LGBTQ plus rights movement? You know, it's incredible to think about how a series of really spontaneous events and demonstrations by members of the LGBTQ community, particularly people of color and transgender individuals, that really began as a response to a police raid on June 28th of 1969 and, and went on for a, a couple different evenings after that, really became the first real time that members of the LGBTQ community rose up in Greenwich Village here in Manhattan and decided that they wanted to fight for the gay liberation movement and really began the 20th century fight for LGBTQ rights here in the United States after facing so much oppression and really an anti-gay legal system for the 1950s and 1960s. It's truly incredible that following much of the civil rights movement of the 1960s and following in the footsteps of that movement and much of what was the anti-Vietnam War movement, the influences began to truly bubble up in Greenwich Village on those hot summer nights in late June and early July of 1969, which kicks off a whole series of over 50 years that eventually culminates in the changes that we've seen today. Thank you so much for joining us today, Christopher. That's all for today's podcast. Thank you to our sponsor, T-Mobile, the leader in 5G. 